Hey guys, in this video we're going to teach you how to create this cool rotating effect when you hover over an image. Hey guys, before we start, I want to mention that I'm using the GitHub VS Code theme. Just in case you like it, go ahead and check it out. Alright, the first thing we want to do is create a container. And within this container, we're going to create another one with a class name of image. All right, let's get access to our container. And this is where we're going to set the width and height for our image. So I'm going to go with a width of 500 pixels and a height of 281. And we're also going to use overflow hidden. And I'm going to comment this out when we're done with the project so you can see what it does if we do not include that. All right, moving on to the image container. Here we have to set the width to 100% and the height to 100%. All right, now let's add the image. So to add the image, we're gonna use background image URL. I'm gonna paste the URL that I'm using for this project, but you can use any image that you want. If you want this particular image, I'm gonna leave a link in the description to the code pen so you can grab this URL. All right, so we have the image, but it's not sitting perfectly within the container. So we're gonna use something else called background position center and also background size cover. All right, so the image is now sitting perfectly within our container. And one final thing we're gonna add here is a transition. And we want it to last 0.3 seconds with an animation of ease in and out. And this just represents how long it's gonna take from when we hover the image to when the animation is done. So it's gonna last 0.3 seconds. So it's gonna happen pretty quick. All right, and finally, we're gonna add the hover effect. So let's add the hover effect to the image class. And to create the rotation, we're gonna use transform together with rotate. And in here, we're gonna include the number of degrees that we want it to rotate. I'm gonna go with 15. Go ahead and change that to whatever you want. And let's say that you want it to rotate the opposite way. All you have to do is change this to negative and now when we hover it it hover it's the opposite way all right so notice that right now we have these empty spaces to get rid of that we're going to stack something else on top of rotate a uh, property called scale and i'm going to use 1.5 for that so now when we hover this it's not only rotating but it's scaling out all right and you might have to adjust this depending on the width and height that you give your image so just make sure to increase that or decrease that uh, to fit your needs. All right. And one final thing we're going to do here is comment this out so you can see what it does without it. So as you can see, it's still doing the trick, but it's not doing it within the container. So to make the trick work, we have to include that. That way it actually rotates and scales out, but it does it within the container. All right. That's going to be it for this tutorial. Please make sure to hit the like button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.